Can't put well. I mean, the guys worked hard. It's been a long two weeks, uh, but you know we've got a, in our locker room. We got a terrific attitude. Um, you know, we certainly lost a lot of talent last year, uh, a lot of experienced guys. Um, but with that, you know, if you can bring in these young guys that got a great attitude, marry it in with the veterans who are coming back, who've paid a price. Um, I really like where we're at right now as a team. We've got a variety of new guys. Uh, it was a very large freshman class. Um, we're very young up front. Uh, we got some guys that are coming in, and uh, Chaz Tooley uh, has been a bright spot for us uh, on the offensive line. Uh, defensively, uh, Jonathan Dooley is, uh, has been a big force at linebacker for us. You look at your quarterback spot uh, right there, that would be Mike McGee. He's a guy that got four starts under his belt last year and performed extremely well. Um, he's, a, he's now considered an old vet. So um, Mike's done a great job leading the offense. Mike Malone uh, is a senior linebacker uh, who's kind of anchoring our defense in the middle. Those two guys right now are the two guys that we're really looking to for leadership and uh, and uh, just keeping that locker room together. Yeah, by the time we get in the locker room, there's, there's people are playing music, and uh, we're just ready to be ready to go out there. We're happy to play ball and uh, compete against each other. We had two scrimmages, um, and what I liked about the two is uh, the first one went well, and the second one we, we did even more. We got to run a lot more plays um, in more situations, which really will help our team down a lot. Yeah, I think they're eager to get on the field to face another opponent. You, know, you get tired of beating up on each other, Especially as, as a player myself, you just get tired of going against the same guys every day. So it'll be exciting for those guys to go against some, some new opponents. So to go out there and, and, and attack the defense, you know, try to attack them downfield, pound the football. Uh, that's what we're going to be. That's our identity. Our football program, since it's been founded here, has really been an independent away from the other sports. It's really nice to finally have a home with the other sports teams here at the college. So you feel more part of the family here. Uh, because we have common opponents um, and I think it's a great opportunity for our football program and we'll all, one to create rivalries with other institutions like us and uh, obviously you know conference championship would mean the world to us. Uh, we're very excited like Coach Hoskall said we've been independent for the last couple of years here um, so we're very excited to go compete and actually win a GMAC championship this year. Uh, we were very fortunate to bring our two coordinators back. Those guys do a great job of Coach L.D. Stallings running our offense and Coach Tarian Smith running our defense. And, uh, and those guys are our stalemates. Uh, and we've added some younger younger coaches, uh, you know, bringing a lot of energy. Uh, Coach Casey Smith, Coach Alex Shepard, Coach Joe Stockton. Um, Charles Decker's back uh, working with our running backs. He's a, he's a returning too. So we've got, and there's other guys. I mean, we've got, got, we got uh, a lot of good faces, a lot of good energy on that field from our coaches. And uh, it's got to start with us. And uh, hopefully it's contagious. And it, thus far it has been with our leadership and it's trickling in that locker room. We got a really close group this year. This year, like, the locker room is really like a brotherhood. We keep preaching brotherhood. And I feel like guys can go to anybody after practice, before practice, and just like talk to them if you need trouble or anything. And as far as um, going out to the field, I feel like the energy, like I said, is just up there. So everybody decided to go out there and compete, practice every day.